Socks in resealable bags? What do you think about that? I was shopping the other day for socks, and I saw socks that came in resealable bags, and I thought, yippee! No, I didn't. That's really silly. Why do I need socks in a resealable bag? Am I worried about their freshness? And if I'm worried about their freshness, I'm not worried about, are the new socks stale? I'm more worried, don't even worry about what I'm worried about, about their freshness. The big thing is the fact that you can buy socks that come in resealable bags. It seems really strange. Why would you even need to do that? I know me personally, when I buy socks, I dump them all into my washer and wash them put them in my drawer and that's it. There you go. End of story. Now, then I got thinking about something which should come in a resealable bag. Say like cereal. Cereal doesn't come in a resealable bag, but socks do. There's never once been a time when I've said to myself, I hope that those socks come in a resealable bag so that way I can keep them all brand new and no, that's sort of really stupid. Instead, I've said things like, I hope that cereal comes in a resealable bag because it'll stay fresher longer. Unless the, st unless the companies that are making the cereal don't want it to stay fresh longer, so that way I'd be forced to buy new cereal. Uh-oh, conspiracy theory coming on here. This could be bad. So, it's sort of strange to me that socks can be resealed, cereal cannot, without some sort of major effort on my part. Wouldn't the cereal companies make more money if I could... No, they wouldn't, would they? If I can reseal my cereal, then they're not going to make as much money off of me. Maybe there really is a conspiracy theory going on here. I would like things that I could use over and over again to come in resealable containers. Say, like, soup and those sort of things. It makes you wonder, doesn't it? Why aren't all these things, which I would actually only use part of in resealable containers, so I could use just part of it. Hmm, maybe there really is a conspiracy theory going on. I'm not saying that I'm going to jump out there and then put on my tinfoil hat, and I'm not saying that all people who have conspiracy theories should be wearing tinfoil hats either, because we've found out that some conspiracy theories have turned out to be true. So those of you who have conspiracy theories before you jump on this bandwagon and tell me how insulting that is, you're not all wrong. But you're also not all right, so it's one of those 50-50 kind of things. There are some people who have conspiracy theories that are way, way out there, I'll give you that. But others are probably real. This one is one of those conspiracy theories that might actually be true. That they want me to spend more money by making it harder for me to keep something fresh longer. Hmm. I don't know. We'll see about that. Tell me what you think. Do you think that cereal needs to come in a resealable bag? Or do you think socks need to come in a resealable bag for freshness? Or for some other reason? Or maybe I'm missing it. Maybe there's really good reason why socks come in a resealable bag. You let me know down in the comments and tell me what you think. Don't forget to subscribe. Every Monday through Friday I talk about something different. Wednesday's always my weight loss journey. Also, you can click on the icon up there which will take you to the latest playlist which will show you the videos that I've done late uh, last uh, in the last couple weeks. It's always fun to hear from you. Tell me what you like, what you don't like, and what you think, or things that you would like me to talk about. I'd love to hear from you. And as, as always, I hope I get to see you again tomorrow.